Pascal, what are the focuses of the DLR? Well, the DLR is the largest engineering research center in aerospace uh, in Europe, but we are also conducting research in uh, energy, transport, security, digitalization, and also in medical research. Tell us about your activities in robotics. Well, we have one of the most famous institutes for robotics and mechatronics in Oberpfaffenhofen, and we will work um, on space technologies, on planetary exploration, but also on orbit ser uh, servicing. And we have developed over three decades uh, very sophisticated robotic arms, which find, you know, uh, due to technology transfer, you know, applications in production technology, but also in medic medical uh, medicine, health and care. So tell us more about your activities in robotics from medicine, please. Yeah, so we have here, for instance, a showcase, which is called the Miro uh, Innovation Lab, and where we work together, uh, together with experts and uh, people from hospitals uh, and uh, industry in order to transfer technologies from space robotics, you know, directly to support the surgeon, minimal invasive surgery, uh, robotic arms, and uh, we also want to, in the future, to develop more for the elderly population and for health care. What are concrete applications currently? Well, one, uh, we have a project which is called SMILE, where we really help uh, people uh, which have uh, reduced mobility uh, to function together with humanoid robots which support uh, their lifestyle and that they can be a little bit more independent again. And the future, of course, uh, is also that we uh, work on technologies where family members or also you know, um, uh, people from healthcare can work interactively also with smartphones uh, or um, uh, tablets and um, uh, somehow operate robots which support uh, people which really need healthcare and want to still live independent. So for space medicine, do you learn from daily routine here on the surface of the earth or is it the other way around? No, actually, you know, robots, the, 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 the hum, human is always in the center. We learn from humans how they behave. And also robots uh, are more or less built, you know, on the performance of humans. We want uh, to understand, uh, you know, how uh, robots can best work and support humans.